Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming, also known as Insane City Gaming. I'm Janice. This is Boomstick. <laughs> TN Dino Tube Sticks. Tube Stick. Yeah. All right. Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. Um, I'm your host, and, and I'm here with. Oh, yeah. TNT Dynamite. I thought that was a real intro. No, for a dude. I just figured I'd felice it. All right. It was all right. I appreciate your the effort. Yeah. If you watched our last video, you'd understand. If not, go back and watch it. Don't, don't go watch it. It's so true. sad, dude. It's it bad. goes into some dark places. Yeah, it probably does. It starts off in a weird place yeah, and then yeah. gets dark and then volleyballs. Yeah, dude. Yeah. <clears throat> We're playing the Dino Saga. Oh, the Saga Might. Yeah, we're in the AFC Championship game, by the way. Hell yeah, Jonas. One more game and we win the Super Bowl. We're going to play the Super Bowl game. Again. We did it. Are we undefeated this season? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> you have 127 touchdowns and 10,000 yards. <laughs> this, that Our tight end has 3,200 yards receiving. Jesus. In a we set some records, bro. 3,200. <laughs> he runs the length of the football field. How many times a game? None. How many games are there? 16. Twice. No. Twice every <laughs> game. He runs the length of the football. Game. Yep. That's we're ridiculous. Good. That's ridiculous. Yeah, man. All right, Jonas. Yes, yeah, sir. Booyakasha, Jonas. Yeah. Favorite onomatopoeia. <laughs> that is like a b plop, a uh, zap. Words that oh yeah, there, words that have power. No words that sound down. like what he they right are talking no, about. I like blop. You the blop boy. I like blop, plop, boom, pow, shang. Ooh, I love a good boom. <laughs> boom, boom. I say boom a lot. Yeah, boom. I do too. I text boom a lot. I'll be you like, da, 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 da. boom. You text boom. And I'll do a mic drop, like it's Obama dropping the mic. Do you game. really? No. <laughs> Yo, that's I, actually kind of I like that. I, I have used the Obama, Obama mic drop and when I do say boom a lot. You have the Obama mic drop? I'll drop yeah. the, yeah, there's the Obama mic drop. Yo, here. send me that. I need that. <laughs> <laughs> Keep that in my repertoire. It's it's just Obama dropping. I don't know where they got it. From. Or average, how many times do you use gifts in a in a in a uh, text conversation? A day? Sure. How many gifts? I've been using them a lot more lately. Yo, they work. They're like advanced emotes, man. <laughs> and well, especially now that I have a searchable gift catalog. Yeah. Like before, I had that. It was a lot. It was what, a lot hard. What do you mean a searchable gift catalog? Like gift you catalog. click GIF on your text, and then there's a search, and you just search, and they all pop up. What? Yeah, dude. Shut up. Yeah, it's because I have a phone that was made in the last seven years. <laughs> okay, look. Because <laughs> I used to never have it. I'm like, dude, it's too much work to like. I just go to Google. Oh, you got it all wrong, bro. Let me show you. No, because no, because look, Jonas, there's I don't know about this gift catalog. I'm like It's like, built into the Android keyboard, man. It's like you're from the future. <laughs> <laughs> like, or the serious? present and you're living in the past. Just saying. Just, Who's the boomer now? I'm okay, I do have an Obama phone. <laughs> oh, everybody in Cleveland. Tonight has Obama phone. God dang it, Jonas. I got an Obama phone. You're right. That's the one boomer thing I do. Yeah. It, I'm like, nope, it still works, Jonas. My phone literally holds a charge for an hour. I know, it is the most insane thing. I have to keep my phone plugged in at all times. I know, and you're just like hard headed about getting a new phone. I, you know, I was honestly, I was in my room today and I was considering. You could go to Metro PCS and get on your own plane for like 40 bucks a month and get a brand new phone for free. Jonas, that is an Obama phone. <laughs> you're, you're like a brand new phone to hand me like a clamshell. Old flip phone. No, you get. No, you get. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, look, you're living in that, dude. You're gonna go from boomer to boomer. Have you seen it though? Dude, I don't care. It's a flip phone, dude. I'm done. What are you? What are you done with? What's the beat? Why are you done with that? With that model? Flip phones? Yeah. Because it's 2019 to 20, bro. I mean, but it's just the difference of opening a phone and closing it, like. <laughs> Does, I don't know, man. Does, I mean, I understand that flip phones are Dead. no longer. <laughs> <laughs> but me. if it's nice. <laughs> I haven't seen Have you seen it, actually? <laughs> I got a. Jonas, <laughs> keep it going, buddy. I'm it. trying to. I'm going to look up the Motorola. The, the Moto. Why don't you send me 
phone, dude. I'll show you this gift catalog in this video. I don't even have anything to drink. Chana, it's I okay. Even keep the video going. I gotta go get a drink. That's fine. It's a really, it's a really nice phone, Jonas. I don't know. I'm thinking about it. But I understand what you're saying. It is, it is antiquated style. But if they, if they fix it, oh, I don't even think it's a flip phone. I think you can get it in flip phone form. I don't know. I'm trying to look at it. There's like different. There's okay, a lot I had of, to get a drink. Sorry. As soon as you show the razor, there's like just a bunch of other razors. Oh, uh, oh, like the old one. Yeah. No. I don't know, John. I'm not. A, I've always been an Android boy, and I can't see myself going to iPhone. I hear people complaining. Oh, about I hate. Their, it. I mean, I don't like the. I don't like the. Yeah. yeah, I hear people complain about their iPhones whenever a new one comes out that uh, the one that they have in their possession starts effing up. Yeah, it's like they. Yeah. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I and think that's true. I think they send out stuff to the old versions to make them. I believe they actually had a case against them for doing that. N maybe not Apple themselves, but it was somebody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, it's like a software thing they do. Yeah. Makes the batteries, like, low charge. It, like, does all sorts of stuff. Because the cell phone, it's it's really a hustle, man. It is a hustle. Oh, yeah. Dude. How are you going to come out with a new phone every year? Every two years? It's like Call of Duty. No, it's every year. Yeah, it was like Call of Duty, dude. Or it's like Madden. Yeah, but your phone, you don't need to replace your phone every year. They're not different. They're the same effing phones. Maybe a little bigger, maybe a better camera. What yeah. do I care? Oh, I'll toss another three megapixels on there. Yeah, like you already have a, a, a 4K camera. What do you need an 8K camera for? I'm not taking them down to pictures. I mean, right. unless my Insta starts blowing up. Yeah, dude. And then I need to take some nice sultry pictures. I'm gonna yeah, get some. it up for the ladies. Put some thirst traps out there for you ladies. Yeah, yeah. TNT traps. TNT and a speedo. Oh god. <laughs> Jesus. Is that not doing it for you? No, dude, it doesn't. But you should get a new phone, man. I you know. Need this gift catalog, dude. Oh my god, it's it's like heaven. But I I, I I like I need a I need a Cleveland number. You need a Cleveland number? Yeah, can I keep my Cleveland number? I'm pretty sure if you... Yeah, you can just put the number you have. That sounds like a lot of work. It's man. not. You yeah. tell them, here's my phone. It's with company A. I just need to bring my number over. These are the times where I think I should have a girlfriend. Cause I, I could work for a phone company. Because I could just have her do it. Yeah. <laughs> like, that was one of the good things about having a, a significant other choice. I could just make them do stuff for me. That is not what you should be saying what are you talking about? <laughs> think about having a significant other is making them do things for I mean, they would do it because they loved you but you didn't have to do it you know yeah <laughs> what are you yep. don't give me you, that look you don't get dinner if you don't i don't what you don't pay for my life. you don't go transfer myself <laughs> what do you think i'm withholding food from her if she doesn't do errands for me well, that sounds like it. i'll withhold that <laughs> beat i'm just kidding i'm kidding but no no you're not no i just like uh you know it's nice to have a nice little proactive female oh you know honey Dude, they are lighting us up. <laughs> That's all right, Jonas. We're going to kick them. We're going to win them. Well, I'm trying, but they keep sacking the F out of us. Yeah. We, we took them up our scrambler quite a bit. You'd think that they, we'd be able to scramble out of there. I did have that one thing where we broke the first... Uh, Oh. Oh, and then he dropped it. Right How? off his tips. Why are you killing his daddy? Why are you killing his daddy? Um, yeah, dude, because I suck. But yeah, man, I'll have to show you this gift catalog. Uh, it's good. You're going to be jelly. It's not the greatest, but it's like it's better than going to Google and saving it to your phone. and then. So I was honestly thinking I might just like buy a phone and then just like. Yeah. Because I, I hate the contract they put you under, they too. Oh, my God. Now we have an interception. And he's going to run it in for. Because I think I use. Uh, uh, who do I who do I, who do I, who do I, who I use? I don't know. But you. If, no, like, use, what they, they don't do contracts anymore, dude. They don't. They do, that's not even an option. They do. Uh, they lease you the phone, so you have to pay for it for like two years, and then you don't own it. It's an even bigger scam than the contract. <laughs> and then. Uh, I don't want to lease the phone. But you can just buy it outright. But you're gonna pay like a grand for it. 
Yeah, I'm thinking about just doing that, though. Yeah, you're, I mean, you can say, I want an uh, Android a Samsung 10. So you yeah. like, I'll pay the $800 for it, and then yeah. you have no confidence that you just have a cheap rate. Exactly. Because the plans are fairly cheap anymore. Yeah. If they put that $30 but, a month plus mm -hmm. fees for your phone that you don't own anyway. And then you got to look at your APR. There's no APR. <laughs> There's no ACR. There's interest. There's interest. There's no interest. You just, the amount you pay, the interest is built into the payment. No, I'm saying, like, if you get, like, a standard plan and you're like, hey, I'll pay $30 a month over this amount of time, you end up paying more than what the phone is worth. Yes. Oh, uh, yeah, the interest is built in. Yes. Because, like, yeah, you're paying $30 a month for, like, 24 months, exactly. and that works out to be, like, $1,000, and the phone is, like, 800 Exactly. So yeah, I'm and thinking, at the end of it, you're like, you don't even own it. So, honestly, that's that's more what, that, that's, like, more of my speed is just go out there and just buy the phone I want, and then just, like, be like, hey. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Yep. I don't, I don't really you. have a problem with how much I pay a month. I don't know. What's, like, a good price to pay a month for a phone? I For a, for a, um. For, for like a, a phone, yeah, for a plan. I don't pay a lot, but I have Sprint. You know, like I've been grandfathered in. That's one. Who do I use? Don't no, bro. I don't follow well, give me some names. Verizon. Yes. Wow, that was easy. <laughs> I could, oh, I, for some reason, I kept thinking Virgin, but I'm like, I know it's not Virgin. Yeah, dude, I have Sprint. I think my phone goes like sixty dollars. Oh, okay, so I pay sixty a month. Yeah, but you're splitting it on a plan or something. If you went solo, it's always completion on second down. Really? Mm-hmm. That's like, like with everything. Like Spotify individuals like nine dollars a month or ten bucks a month. So you get the family paying seventeen dollars a month, and you get six accounts. Hmm. So it's like, well, why wouldn't I want the seventeen dollar a month plan? Because it's only you get way more for your money. The family plan, you're like paying eighty five dollars for yourself, or two lines is one thirty, so it's sixty five a person. So they can get you all the like app lines. Isn't, isn't this ridiculous, Jonas? When you think about how everything's a freaking subscription now. Your phone is a subscription. Yes. Your internet is yes. a subscription. Yes. Uh, your music is a subscription. Yes. There's subscription. There's a GD oh, <laughs> car wash that has a subscription plan where you pay them $19 a month and you get unlimited car wash. Is, is that a good deal? Absolutely. It's a great deal. But how many car washes would you get in pay $19 a month? Bum, bum, bum. You only go once every so often, so you're really not. You're really just paying for something you don't need. But it, that's, that's not true. Because the feeling of having a shiny a shiny car is a good feeling. That's not the question. I didn't say it didn't feel good. If you didn't have a $19 a month plan, would you go every month and get your car washed? No. Uh, yeah. How often have you had your car washed? We're, we're 11 months into this year. How many times have you went and had your car washed? I used to go, okay, look, check no, no, no. it. I, this year, 2019, how many times have you went and had your car washed? That's, that's my whole point. It's a lot. Yes, because I got the subscription. Oh, I got So you. every time I was over there, I'd be like, F it. I'm just going to stop in and get a car wash, get my money's worth. Well, right. So I've probably gotten about 50 to 60 car washes this year. Just because you have the plan. But if you wouldn't have the plan. But I also show up to to work and I show up to uh, events with the shiny new See, car. I don't like and flashy. I'm not sure. It's not about being flashy. Cleaning my car does not make me flashy. It does. It does. You just, you just said you show up with a shiny car. Yeah, but what's the problem with that? That's flashy. Bro. That's not. It's not about flash. It's just about keeping your car clean, not being. All right, they ain't twins about keeping clean. I mean, honestly, it. I kind of feel like the opposite end of the spectrum, rolling around a dirty, uh, a dirty ass Honda Civic, makes you look trashy. Does it? Yes. What if, it's just like if you got a car burning up rubbers on the road, bro. <laughs> if you drive around a dirty ass car with wash me on the back of it, people are gonna be like, that's kind of effed up. And then you gotta to spend that twenty dollars to get that one car wash because a car wash is going for fifteen dollars nowadays, fam. I don't know if you've been out in these streets. Dude, I went to the streets and I had a car wash one time. So it was garbage. I got the worst car wash. It, and they're bad. You want to know the best thing about getting a subscription to the car wash? It's okay because if it's bad, I go through again. <laughs> Dude, I've done that. I went to the car wash before I went on a trip out of town, and. I just wanted to get my car washed. And the guy literally was like, we're going to be so good if you get this extra car wash. He goes, see right here? See this little speed came into my on my dash. See how it's dirty right here? We'll clean that. We'll get you. We'll get you. Oh, detailing. 
So I went through the wash, came out. The, the area he touched was not even clean. And I, was, I went to him, I said, you literally pointed it out, you were gonna clean this, and you didn't clean it. He's like, I'm so sorry, let me get somebody out there. Come out, the rims are still dirty. Like, I'm like, what are you doing here? Like, what is this kind of garbage ass? How much did that car wash cost I don't eat nothing because they gave me a free one. No. <laughs> After I had to have them redo my car three times. How much would it have cost you? I don't know, like $25 or something stupid. And that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. I kind of feel like the subscription model is great, but only if you're out there because it was always convenient because it was right next to like where I had to work. Right, right, right. So I would like leave where I had to work. And I'm like, hey, look, I can make a right, go a half a second down the, and just turn into the car wash and boom, then I can come home or right, whatever. Right, right, yeah, yeah. At the end of the day, I'd be like, yeah, I'll get a car wash real quick. Right, right. I get you. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, or in the middle of the day, I'm like, oh, I'll get some lunch, get a car wash. Yeah, but yeah, dude. Like, subscription models are weird. Oh, everything, Jones. Everything. Madden is basically a subscription model. 60 bucks a year, man. Video games are quickly becoming a subscription model. <laughs> well, everything is, man. It's like, that's the way of the future. I mean, it's going to have to be that because they're trying to get rid of loot boxes now, man. They got just kind of like a negative stigma attached to them. Yeah, EA ruined that. Yeah, they did actually. Uh huh. If they wouldn't have been greedy about, yeah. if they wouldn't have hidden Darth F Invader behind a paywall, yep. no one would have ever been none the wiser. People were so mad. They had loot boxes in Overwatch. That game has been out for four years. <laughs> they had loot boxes in Overwatch since its inception. Nobody had a problem with it. As soon as EA is like, oh, how can we fleece the public? That's when they were like, everybody's like, yo. It was about the Star Wars Battlefront 2. Oh, yeah, I like, remember that. People were like, I have to play 100 hours to get Darth Vader or pay money for him. Yeah, and then, like, this. the world exploded. Yeah. Star Wars fans, man. They're like the Beyonce Beehive movies. Yeah, dude, I feel you, man. More like the Barbs, actually, because. The Barbs? What's that? That's uh, Nicki Minaj's group. What are, are they games? Her fans, essentially. Are they games? Nope. <laughs> they are mean, and she has been known to weaponize weaponize her following oh like she'll be like get him yeah she'll be like tell this mf how how we do out here and then like all the people on twitter will attack them and that's why i call them barbs because those are aggressive uh african cichlids the beehive is not as bad it's essentially about like jonas once we get big enough if we get enough people who actually listen to us then we'll have the crazy townsfolk. And then when, like, Elon Musk does something stupid, you like, get them townsfolk. And then they'll just go on there and troll the hell out of them. Really? Is that what we have to look forward to? That's what we got to look forward to. <laughs> Our own personal cult. <laughs> Once a year, we'll have a gathering of the townsfolk. <laughs> oh, yo, that's great. That's actually the gathering of the townsfolk, dude. Yeah, we'll have our town hall meeting. We'll all float, fly in, dude. We'll do a live podcast. We'll record videos with a live audience. Let's we'll play Madden with microphones, and the townsfolk will be there, town hall meeting. Yeah, we let one of them come on, three mics. Hell yeah. They rotate in every quarter. Woo, they have a contest. What? Have a contest who gets to be on the video with us. And bobbing for apples. Bob. <laughs> I thought you were going to say Bob and like Frapples, and I was like, who is Frapples? <laughs> okay. That's fine. Yeah, dude. I like that yeah, idea. Yeah, I like that. The I'm the in, I'll plan it all myself. Yeah. We should, we should do Twitter again. It's hard, though. Dude, it's just, it's, I don't have time for any Twitter. And I don't think about Twitter. I just can't really think about Twitter. Dude, I can't get in it. you got to spend a lot of time on that. That's my boomer, boomer moment right there, Jonas. I can't do Twitter. I found that, like, I used to put a lot of time into Twitter and to get, to get like, listens to the podcast and yeah. stuff. And I found out that, like, if I didn't do anything, we didn't get that many less listeners. <laughs> like, you know, is the effort worth? Yeah. I was also very lonely and by, all by myself all the time and sad. Oh, wow. No, that's actually true. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and now I have, I now I have life. And uh, I don't want to spend my time doing that. 
Oh, well, well, that's perfectly fine, sir. You had a subscription model of that, too, as I recall. Everything is. Yeah, dude, it's great. I feel like owning a car is a subscription model because I have to pay for gas. Oh, he's happy. No, he's not. He's sad. Yeah, it is. Breathing is a subscription model because I have to inhale and exhale. Or I don't breathe. God forbid I breathe for free. God forbid that breath is free. I gotta expend all these calories and carbs. Dude, I expended everything. Like, eating food is a subscription policy. Jonas. Is it? Yes. It's like loot boxes, Jonas. Every time I go to a restaurant, I have to pay the money and then they give me a loot box. Well, if the food sucks, then I got a common. But it's not a loot box. You get to choose what you want. They don't. You don't just walk in and say, hey, here's no. 10 bucks. Give me food. And they throw some on a plate for you. So it's a microtransaction. Yeah, it's, a, it's right. actually a major transaction. Yeah, it's, but it's just a full transaction. <laughs> it's a transaction. All right. <laughs> it's just <laughs> all right, fair enough. <laughs> all right, everybody. That's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you haven't done that, do that. If you haven't done that, <laughs> if you haven't done that, <laughs> just tell everyone in your life. Yeah, everyone, do it again. For do Jonas it. and TNT Dynamite. All right, we'll catch you on the next one. We are. Oh.